Hello all, wherever you may be in the world today. I've been posting on the Custom Bats forum site for about the last week and a half about the Stretton Foxes that I've ordered and I quite happily say that they arrived with me in Brisbane today. So as I usually do with all the new gear I get, I'm going to give it a bit of a video review for you guys. I know I've already posted some photos but I'm going to show a review anyway. So first of all we've got the, the rucksack here that it arrived in. We've got the Stretton Fox logo on the back of it. Great little idea for them to come in so they can fit nicely in the kit bag and you won't lose the, extra, the straps and stuff like that in the bag. But more importantly, let's get on with the thigh pads. Just put that behind you. Got the thigh pads. We have the outer thigh pad, which has been moulded to my leg with my last name there. And we've got the wraparound inner thigh pad with my initials there going on the inside. Great looking pads. I really like what George and I have come up with here. These are the bespoke option with the black strip through there and we've decided with the 80 sci-fi font as it has been described as the orange with the lines I think it's come up really well and I think George thinks the same as well so I'll just leave them there I asked to come with black straps but George being the great person he is has sent me two sets of straps he sent me the black toweling straps which I asked for which are the, these are the little ones here Go around the bottom half length, but they've got the Stretton Fox tag and strettonfox.com. And that's the long one there. Stretton Fox, the full website on it, strettonfox.com. And he's also sent to me the white elastic tag if I want to go the more natural look, which are also got the lovely Stretton Fox tag and the two small white ones as well. I'm going to quickly just put it on for you now on my fox so first things first I get the little one put it on around the bottom there just fix it in the place so that holds it on there get me inner thigh pad and my large strap and I feed it through I will more than likely just leave these set up in my kit bag future reference but at the moment they can stay there so that one can stuck on there into there back around the other side and my last little black strap get a hold hold the inner side that in these are really comfortable you can move around in them you can see I'm not inhibited by any movement at all. I've still got to bend them in a little bit, like just down here, I've just got to slightly bend it. But that's what George encourages you to do anyway, bend them to your shape. But I am in love with these from the get-go. They fit my legs perfectly. I had them up against my arrows earlier, and if you take the thigh guard of the Aero P1s and put it up against this one, it is this one is actually larger than the arrows. The only reason the arrows look larger is because they have the hip protector up here and I could get one I could get one of those if I wanted to from George. But all in all, great thigh pads, really strong. You can hear them that they're pretty strong. And I just think no I don't have a mallet in my bag, I'm just gonna give them mallet more legs a bit of a whack, but that's not gonna do anything. They're really really good stuff. So thank you all for listening in today. I hope you like the review. I wish to thank George for all his work. I hope he continues to produce such great products in the future. So cheers guys, have a good day.